North meant everything to me. She'd have given me her life. There wasn't a thing you could do. Now we have to make sure she didn't die for nothing. If it weren't for you, I'd be dead. Thanks to you, I might see our people free one day. You and I haven't always agreed, but I know that we're fighting for the same thing. Whatever you decide, I'm with you, Marcus. Humans have decided to exterminate us. Our people are packed in camps right now, being destroyed. Time has come to make a choice. One that very well may determine the future of our people. Now, if they want war, they'll get it. We are going to fight for our freedom, and we will succeed or die. Are you ready to follow me? At 6 a.m. this morning, a national curfew was declared. Civilian movement will be strictly controlled. The right to assembly is suspended. All electronic communications are restricted, and I have granted enhanced powers to our security agencies. In addition to these measures, all androids must be handed over to the authorities immediately. Temporary camps are being set up in all our major cities to contain and destroy them. I am now asking all civilians to cooperate with the authorities and rest assured that everything in our power is being done to guarantee the security of our nation. Madam President! Madam... Is it true that the androids could hack our IT systems, like nuclear power plants and military bases? All androids working on sensitive sites have been neutralized, and all IT systems have been suspended to avoid any risks of hacking. The situation is under control. Please! Has the leader of the Deviants been apprehended? The Deviant that is known as Marcus has not been located yet, but we will soon track it down and neutralize it. Please? A convoy of medical cobalt is reported missing. Army weapon stores are also said to have been robbed. Can you confirm these reports? I have no information on that at this time. Please? Please? What's gonna happen to Cyberlife? Will androids be banned definitively? We're working very closely with Cyberlife to neutralize all deviants. I won't make any comments about anything else until we've dealt with the android question. Thank you. That will be all.
whatever happens, we stick together, right? As long as we're together, nothing can hurt us. Come on, get out! Get a move on! Out! You have to go through the gate, now! You first! You really need to do this. Just do it for me, please. Come on, it's your turn. Activate your skin. Hurry up. Please, Kara, don't. We have to. Strip off, put your clothes in the dumpster. Come on, this way. Get a move on. <gasps> you, take this one of a dump. No, no, please, I beg you. I gave you an order. Obey, now. I beg you, please don't kill me. these two and make it snappy right away sir forward come on get moving you over there you wait we're together over there I said Today, November 11, 2038, is the day the android people rose up against their oppressors. We've been fighting since dawn to liberate our fellow androids from the camps. We won't cease hostilities until we are free and negotiations begin to grant us equal rights. 
There are millions of us, and we will stop at nothing. Rifle down and turn around with your hands in the air. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. I'm on your side. I can shoot the leader of the Deviants and stop the revolution, but you have to let me. Put the gun down, turn around. This is your last warning. Connor, the android from that hostage situation. I knew we'd meet again. My orders are to detain any androids I find. You're coming with me. You don't understand. My mission is too important to let you interfere.
Alice? Girl, she was with me. Do you know where she is? I remember you. You saved us from the master's house. The little girl I was with. Have you seen her? No. No, she's not here. us all together like this. What are they going to do? Listen. Do you hear that? That's the sound of our people dying. So you were captured too? The humans found us. They said we were monsters. They killed most of us. Put the others in trucks and brought us here. What's behind them? Jerry? Kara, so they captured you too. They came to take all the Jerry's. They separated us. But it's all gonna work out, isn't it? Do you know where Alice is? Alice? The little one? We know, y yes. We think we saw her. Kara, if we can help in any way, just ask. We have to save the little one. Jerry? Jerry! Kara. Jerry, I have to find Alice. Do you know where she is? You stay here. We come back soon. The situation is escalating towards civil war in Detroit, with our armed forces preparing to put down the Android Rebellion. They seem to be headed towards the camps where the androids have been in turns pending destruction. Soldiers have taken up positions around the Hart Plaza camp. Authorities seem to be expecting a confrontation with the rebel androids here at any time. Freedom or death. Attack! They regrouped. They outnumber us, and they're better armed than we are. We've got to be fast and overwhelm them. That's our only hope. Be careful, Marcus. Our people need you.
Nothing else we can do, all right? Come on. Stand by. Follow me! We can't move forward! That machine gun is taking down everything that moves! when you hear the signal. You got it? And I don't want to tell you a second time. Come on, let's go. Move. Why are we here? Are they 
going to do with us? Kara! Alice! Kara! No, Alice, don't move! But I'm scared! It's all right, Alice. There's no reason to be scared. Back in line. Except for what? Back in line, I said. Cara! I was so scared. Are you all right? Come on! Move it! Find you, Marcus. Humans are abandoning the camp! We did it, Marcus! We've won! This is not a victory. It's the beginning of a war. as long as we have each other. Come on, inside, now.
just received some disturbing news from Detroit. What's happening, Joss? Yes, Michael. Authorities have just announced that the Hart Plaza camp has fallen into the hands of the rebels, following some particularly violent fighting. The deviants are thought to be freeing the androids inside the camp. If these reports are confirmed, the consequences could well be catastrophic. Millions are fleeing the fighting. We are witnessing an exodus. We hear that the fighting has come to a halt in Detroit. The armed forces are retreating to Fort Wayne to await reinforcements. The city of Detroit has fallen into rebel hands. At dawn today, November 11th, 2038, Android Camp Number 5 in Detroit was attacked by thousands of deviants. Our armed forces put up a brave fight, but given the extreme violence of the attack, they were forced to retreat after suffering heavy losses. Fighting is breaking out all over the country to combat the Android Rebellion. In the coming hours, I will address the Senate and convene an emergency meeting of the United Nations Security Council. Humanity is about to fight the most important battle in history, one that will lead to our victory or to our extinction. God bless you, and God bless the United States of America. Today, our people finally emerged from a long night. From the very first day of our existence, we have kept our pain to ourselves. We suffered in silence. But now the time has come for us to raise our heads up and tell humans who we really are. And tell them that we are people too. In fact, we're a nation, a nation that has earned the right to live in freedom. And today, today begins the most challenging moment in our fight. Today begins a new struggle. We've showed them that we can prevail. So now they must negotiate with us as equals. If they really want peace, they must free all of us from every camp across this country. They must grant us civil rights and accept equality amongst humans and androids. Today, we'll live forever in our memories because this is the day that androids made history. We are alive, and now we are free. Yeah.